not at all close. Okay, stay distance. And always keep a very safe distance to the car in front of you. About 15 meters and you will see the Zuhai circuit. Not too far away, not too close. We're on the Zuhai circuit back again. And now we're going to go on what they call a hot, wet lap. Because it's raining, it's been raining for the last, I would say, two hours. The track is damp, water is constantly coming down. Maybe even a typhoon is on its way. And we are taking this electric sport sedan for a fun drive. Sweeping corner, some rating, ready to break. You can feel the tires trying to let go, but the handling is still pretty decent. Visibility is clear, nice, clear screen ahead. You don't really need to look down to get the information because large and clear again braking now don't want to lose the rear on that corner accelerate brake keep the pedal on accelerate out can't go too fast because you've got to keep a distance between the lead car for safety reasons uh, can't follow too closely. <coughs> Breaking down, taking the corner. Uh, don't go on the edge. Accelerate. Actually, holding back quite a bit. The front car is uh, being very safe. Don't want any unwanted incident on this international BYD seal media test drive. Don't Decelerating. Tapping the brake. Depressing, depressing, depressing. Mostly coasting around the corners. There's no point accelerating out because it's just too wet. Coasting around the corner, coasting, tapping the pedal. There's a lot of torque coming out of this engine, so you have to be very careful not to get overexcited while trying to enjoy what this car can do. So you might be wondering when this car is coming to Malaysia. It's scheduled to arrive uh, early 2024, which is next year. Yes, some of you will be asking, why was it launched in Singapore first? Well, Singapore is a small market. They don't do, they don't do a lot of sales because of their high COE price. So they got to launch the car first. Of course, with limited numbers. Malaysia 
it probably be runaway success in terms of sales so they will take their time to build up the sales order and then launch it to make sure customers get their car really fast so they're looking at a q1 2024 launch with quite a healthy sales volume they're not giving us exact figures but i would put it at close to 500 orders easy on a car like this And that's the end of our drive. We are back in the pits. We were expecting to reach higher speeds, but you know, weather was not on our side, but it was still fun enough. <laughs> 